I'm comparing two powerful container management tools, Portainer and Podman, so you can pick the one that fits your workflow best. First up, Portainer. This is a web-based GUI for managing containers across Docker, Kubernetes, Swarm, even Podman. It serves everyone from home users to enterprise teams. For hobbyists, the Community Edition is free and easy to install. You get a visual dashboard to deploy containers, manage volumes, monitor logs, and tweak settings without touching the command line. Enterprises can upgrade to paid plans starting around $99 a month for five nodes, unlocking role-based access, audit logs, backup tools, and commercial support. The trade-off? It abstracts away the CLI, which is great if you prefer UI, but sometimes menus hide advanced configurations. Next, let's talk Podman. It's a daemonless open source container engine that works like Docker but runs securely without root. You manage containers, pods, and images via CLI or use Podman Desktop for GUI control. Podman supports rootless mode, systemd integration, and even generates Kubernetes YAML from your setups. It's free, extremely secure by design, and ideal for developers and sysadmins who prefer command line control and deep integration. The downside? It's not packed with visual dashboards. GUI management requires the extra desktop app, and you're still hands-on with system configs. So which one should you pick? If you want a slick, user-friendly dashboard to manage containers across environments, Portainer is the way to go, especially if you're running containers in production and need access controls, auditing, and support. If you prefer secure, scriptable CLI-based workflows with rootless execution and tight integration into Linux systems, Podman wins. It's the choice for power users who want maximum control and security. Bottom line, choose Portainer for a polished, visual container experience with enterprise-ready features. Opt for Podman if you want rootless, daemonless power with command line flexibility and security.